game and Thomas Rundle, and you were talking about second phases here on set pieces. I mean, Barca has given up so many goals and Madrid has scored so many after the 89th minute. Again, a second phase, no pressure on Marcelo. Stay with your mark where it doesn't happen. Allows the best header of the ball to get deep again, Ramos. Ram Thanks for coming. Ramos hits the post. I know. Yeah. So he gets the ball okay. again in that, the box. That wasn't the prettiest of goals. This one certainly was from Lionel Messi. Yeah, it's brilliant. It's, it's, the, it's the pace at which he does it. A lot of strikers can do what he does. None of them can do it as quickly as he does. Even Carver Hall goes for a tackle, pulls his foot away, says, I can't get to this guy. Oh, another good save from the keeper. I mean, uh, Christian, now you oh, know the value of keepers, eh? Hey, this goalkeeper was fantastic today. Like you said, if they weren't in this good form today, yeah. we, we, we would have seen a 6-4 game. Which, which I think says something, is that these are two great teams who created a, a load of fantastic scoring opportunities. Very late on then in the first half, an opportunity. What about the goalkeeping there, Gary? Uh, he, was he was pushed. Suarez. By no one, but he was pushed. Uh, <laughs> come on. Suarez falls all over. Look at Suarez here. He leans back into the keeper, hits him with oh, his elbow. Come on, referee. So we go into the second half. It's 1 1, and both teams come out fighting again in this one, and we're seeing chances coming so close yet again, Tommy. Incredible. Bomber talked about Marcelo being able to go forward again in the open play. The crosses that he gets up, the assist on the goal that we've seen already, and the goalkeeper just continue on both sides. Navas or Ter Stegen keeping their team in the game. That's important right now at 1 1. And this is a Gary Bailey fantasy right now. <laughs> it is, it is, it is. Uh, it's, it's a good save, but again, give PK credit. They're creating opportunities both sides, taking opportunities, absolutely brilliant. Oh, nearly pulls that one off, CL7. Yeah. Marco Asensio had to come on for Gareth Bale, who couldn't complete this game. Had just come back into action as well and been put straight in the lineup, and it continued. Wow, this was an easy, not an easy goal, but the goal was open. Does he, is, he shoot, is he supposed to shoot there for you, yes. Asensio? Yes, if I'm a sensor, I shoot on the goal. Ronaldo was two up. The ball was given too far back. That's why Ronaldo hit it. He was already, if you could see, that his body was over the ball. In front of the ball, sorry. In front of the ball. Into question yeah. again, Gary. And they keep the save. It's end-to-end it's -end stuff. And it, it could have been goals either way. Now, this this is a shocking tackle, and I don't, I don't care who you are. There's no way you persuade me there was anything other than a blatant, disgusting tackle and a red card. This is a, tri a triple, triple red card. Triple red card. Yeah. Triple, red card. Yeah. triple red card. He missed a chance to see a Rakitic goal there, but then the equaliser came from Canis Rodriguez, who came on in this one and made a difference for his side. And, and who crosses again, Bobo? Mr. Marcelo. Yes, yes. The most important player in the, on the pitch, as Bobo had said. And I tell you, Busquets doesn't stay with the runner. Hamas does well getting near post. Tucks that one away. Brilliant football by Madrid. And we'll get back and we'll show you the Rakitic goal in moments to come, which was, as Ray Hudson says, a galasso, lasso, lasso, lasso. But then what about this one? Very late on in the contest. We'll get to this momentarily. Messi starting to pull the strings. Here it is. The goal. Wow. For Rakitic from distance. We're going back in time a little bit. That's hey, okay. Time machine here. Have we? <laughs> we the future. Uh, By the way, real quick, he's got more goals for midfield than any other midfield before Barcelona. I think this is a seven on the year. And Highly hey, underrated, by the way. It's a great strike because there's no way Kayla can get to it. Absolutely wow. brilliant. We get late on in this game and the chances do keep coming. We do keep seeing these saves. But late on, we were wondering if we'd see Ramos time. We knew that wasn't going to be the case. Now it's Lionel Messi time. Messi, put him on the table, baby. You're bleeding. You're hurt. But you're winning this game. I love it. Vamos, vamos, dale, dale. How crazy is this? When Jordi Alba gives the ball back, we all thought if Messi's going to come, he's yep. going to score that goal. That's I don't right. know why, but 